Okay, Diedrich, Devin Shea, Williams, please. He's here on primary judge. Okay. All right, Mr. Williams, you are charged with... One count of first degree murder. You have which you are going to be held no bond at this point. Count two is a probation violation, no bond hold. And you also have operating without a valid driver's license, which the convenience bond is $25. I can tell you on the probation violation, sir, you are going to be going before your division judge on that charge, which is Judge, uh, which is Michael Usan. Division FP this Monday, June twenty fifth at eight thirty. Check it out now. Okay, okay. Now uh, the cops have made an arrest in the murder of XXX Tacion. Okay, it's a guy named Diedrich D Williams, and he's twenty two years old. He's also from Broward County, and he was charged with one count of first degree murder now he went to court and he showed up in court today and the judge said there will be no bond also by the way this guy was on probation and he had other charges that was pending okay cocaine possession domestic violence aggravated assault with a firearm and grand theft order this guy had it all okay this guy basically was a career criminal now he's charged with the murder of xxx and tacion and cops are saying hey we have two more open warrants out. We're looking for two more people. We believe three people were involved in the murder or the plot to murder XXX Tentacion. Now, we don't know still what are the full details. We don't know if maybe if this guy did it, if he went to kill X. We don't even know if he pulled the trigger. We don't know if he just drove the car. We don't know if it was really a robbery going wrong. We will hopefully find this out in due time, but it is a good sign that he's now in custody. The mother of X clearly feels a little bit relieved that the cops are working, and the fact that they're looking for the other two guys means that they're going to get everybody in custody and figure out what the fuck is going on. I will say, and I don't know this young man, but I pray to God for his soul because if he did what he's accused of being doing, if he killed X, He's a disgusting human being, okay? Nothing but that I could say, okay? I don't know if this is random. I don't know if he knew X before. I've seen people tagging a lot of pictures of maybe mutual people between them. So maybe somebody who knew him knew X. Who knows, okay? And we'll figure this out. But I will say, I'm glad the Florida and especially the Broward County Sheriff Office is working overtime to try to make sure this gets solved and that this doesn't go down as another unsolved crime, okay? He's held without bond, as he should be, and to keep in mind, he's on probation already. He should not even be getting arrested again, much less being charged with murder, all right? We're going to keep you guys updated. They're looking for the two other suspects, and when they get those niggas in custody... We'll do another report on that, too. Again, I'm sorry for so many reports, and I, I want to be honest with y'all. Like, I'm heavily invested in seeing this thing through to justice, and I know a lot of fans are. This is part of us mourning and grieving and getting closure, so I'm trying to follow that process through as well. Make sure you guys like, definitely subscribe. Also, for the other individual, the soldier kid guy who was being accused Cops did investigate things with him, but at this time, it looks like he's not in custody, and we're not sure if cops are going to arrest him at some point, but he may have not been involved at all, and he probably just got, he used the situation for free clout, and I'm disappointed at many individuals in this, because if he's innocent, he's disgusting for kind of using this to kind of propel his rap career, and also people are wrong for pinning him as a murderer when he was not, okay? We'll get more details, and I'll keep you guys updated. Make sure you guys like, definitely subscribe to Boy Academics. I'm